I'm Anya Mueller and thanks for joining me today for FastCast this Thursday, June 12th. In local news, Feeding South Dakota held a celebration yesterday in honor of exceeding their $2 million goal in Rapid City's portion of the statewide hand-to-hand -hand capital campaign. Since the campaign started just over a year ago, the community was able to raise $2,048,000 towards a new facility. This facility allows an increase of food distribution to those struggling in our area. Feeding South Dakota board members celebrated by burning the mortgage to the building now that it is finally paid off. So if you ever find yourself alone in an airport, which may never happen, you may consider lip syncing to Celine Dion, then putting it on YouTube. That's what this guy did, who claims he was at the Las Vegas airport all by himself. Oh. of asking a friend to rub sunscreen on your back could soon be a thing of the past. One skincare company claims to have invented the first drinkable sunscreen. The drinkable sunscreen is not FDA approved or scientifically tested in any way and it just sounds gross. If you are needing some golf tips and are a novice golfer, watch Golf Tips on NewsCenter1.tv where J.R. Hamblett from the Arrowhead Country Club teaches Anna Wedham some golf tips. Click on Community, then Golf Tips. Well, today is National Jerky Day. This day marks only the third annual celebration of the dried meat snacks, which is sponsored by the Wisconsin Beef Council. And this day in history, in 1994, Nicole Brown Simpson and Ron Goldman murdered. Nicole Brown Simpson, famous football player O.J. Simpson's ex-wife, and her friend Ron Goldman are brutally stabbed to death outside Nicole's home in Brentwood, California. And do you remember where you were during the White Bronco chase? Here's a look at the Rapid City Area 7-day forecast. That's all for FastCast today. I'm Anya Mueller for News Center One. Have a great Thursday.